Well, look who it is. Systems engaged. Initiating sterilization lockdown. What the hell is he talking about, Joshua? Good things, lads. Good things. to get out of this place. Now! Security Sentinel 503, offline. Initiating emergency core relocation protocol. If I didn't know better, I'd say that was the heart of a mother crystal.
<laughs> I knew that fallen thing was no match for you. Allow me to apologize for earlier. That was, uh, ill played. All born of a misunderstanding, though. Can we start again? We don't need your apologies. We need answers. And you're going to give them to us. I uh, suppose you'll be wanting to know about the tower, then. As you've probably guessed, this isn't the first time we've been here. Fact is, my people have been coming to this place for centuries. Have they now? To these ruins in particular? Aye, well, they, uh, talked to us. Told us what this lot was all for. And what is it for? Well, believe it or not, the Fallen were actually using this place to make their own, uh, Mother Crystal. Though, despite years of searching, all we ever found was shards. Then, Harpocrates was right. It would seem that the Fallen did indeed acquire the gods' ability to craft crystals. I wouldn't go that far. The shards aren't exactly divine. They're not even what you'd call decent. But they're better than nothing, and nothing is what our people had before we found them. So we've been coming here ever since. But these dust crystals have only recently appeared on the black market. What made you decide to start selling them? The skies. Once they went dark, the crystals started growing back till there were more than you could count. And with the mothers all cracked, anyone with anything that could muster so much as a spark had people queuing up to take their coin. Yes, at a cost to us all. Quality apart, these crystals are no different from the ones the world has been using since the dawn of time. And it cannot continue. No, it cannot. While this is clearly none of Ultima's doing, there can be little doubt but that it serves his cause. Then our path is clear. So let's do what must be done. Wait, you lot aren't thinking what I think you're thinking, are you? Oh, I think there's a good chance we are. But, but uh, what about... What about the tower's defenses? That thing you just fought, it won't be the last one. And the further you climb, the worse they'll get. How about we head back to Martha's before someone gets hurt, eh? That is sound advice, which I suggest you take before someone gets hurt.
And that makes two. Yes. But of how many? Well, that depends on how determined they were to conceal their activities. Transferring Sentry Prototype AM-2 to Stasis Silo West. We'll just have to hope those crystals it's sporting are as worthless as the others. to animate them all would be unfathomable. No wonder they were trying to manufacture their own crystals. Unable to establish connection. Placing threat index. It seems we've made an impression. Perhaps the rest of the cages will open now. Don't tempt fate, Joshua. Forgive me, brother. They... may not?
Unauthorized entry detected. Primary core firewalls activated. Initializing iconoclastic defense system Omega-1. What the hell is an iconoclastic defense system? I have a feeling we're about to find out. And that we will not like the answer. Sterilization protocol. Well, at least we know where it is this time. Quite. And if we want it. <laughs> if we want it. All we have to do is kill an icon. Safety routines disabled. Weapons armed. Stand clear. assessment complete recalculating threat level weapon routines authorized rerouting core power to omega one not yet and what makes you say that
kill the Heat Brother. Seems like it still has some fire left in it.
control unit. Offline. Initiating emergency core extraction. Would you care to do the honors, Clive? <laughs> Gladly. What? I thought I told you to leave this place. What must you ruin us all? I, I cannot let you do that. We need these crystals. They're all we have. And just who is this we? We are of an ancient tribe. One of the first to lose its lands to the blight. For countless years, we were forced to roam the Twins. A nation without a Mother Crystal. A people without a blessing. So we found our own. The Dust Crystals provide us a means to survive. Yes, but at what cost? Like all crystals, these shards channel ether. And where do you think that ether comes from? It sucked from the land, as a leech sucks blood from a beast. And what? You just expect us to believe that? No, but that doesn't make what we've told you any less true. If this heart is anything like the others, it will bleed the twins of their life force, till naught remains, naught but death. The proof is all around. What do you think robbed your people of their home in the first place? We are trying to stop that from happening again. And this is the only way. Fuck me! You're Sid! You saw what happened after the Empire lost Drake's head. What do you suppose they will do when they find out, as they surely will? that there is another heart hidden right here under their noses. Your people's need will count for naught. Damn it. It doesn't look like we have much of a choice. But you said you didn't believe him, Chief. I don't. But the man does have a point. There's no keeping this place a secret now. And hanging on to these crystals will only get our people killed. Have it your way, then. Just promise me you'll leave my people out of it. Stand back. It's about to get hot in here. Uh, 
thought we did the right thing. We all saw the crystals fade, but what of the cages? We barely even explored half of the chambers. Mm, without the heart to sustain them, I doubt those still slumbering in the tower will stir now, if ever. I hope you're right. The last thing the world needs is one of those six-legged pests running around wreaking havoc. We have more than enough two-legged pests to deal with as it is. However blameless they may claim to be. What? Oh, two-legged. Right. Sorry. I was just wondering what I'm going to tell the village elders when we get back. I suppose I'll just beg them for forgiveness, and when that doesn't work, give them the slip and lie low for a year or two. You're planning to run away? Again? What? It's got us this far, hasn't it? I mean, we may have had a bit of help, like... Kind of you to remember. Will you and your people be all right? Oh, we've made do without before. I reckon we'll survive. And if what you said is true, it's not like the rest of the realm's going to have it much easier. Besides, one man's ordeal is another man's opportunity, as the old saying goes. I don't recall ever hearing that one, but... fine. Now, if you don't mind, we've got places to be. We do? I mean, we do. Uh, thanks for uh, everything. I said, we've got places to be. Back to the hideaway then. Karen and Hippocrates will want to hear about this. Uh, I was thinking we might first return to the tower and see if we can... Back to the hideaway, then. Back, are you? So? Did you find out where the dust crystals were coming from, or what? It's, uh, a long story. And perhaps one better told in the shelves. Bloody hell. 
remind me never to go poking round in any fallen ruins. <sighs> Not only a mother crystal of human creation, but an icon as well? Truly, the study of our fallen forebears is endlessly rewarding. The wonders of which they were capable never ceased to amaze. They came as something of a surprise to us, too. You can say that again. We had no idea what we were getting ourselves into when we set foot in that tower. We only knew the old stories. Of a people so consumed by greed that they sought to overthrow the gods. And I'd hazard the thing we found in that tower was conceived for that very purpose. Omega. The offspring of the Fallen's boundless knowledge and unchecked ambition. A dangerous combination for all concerned. And Ultima crushed them. It was he whose secrets the Fallen coveted, let's not forget. He whom they strove to dethrone. Just as we strive to dethrone him now. Without their knowledge. And without their weapons of war. Clive. This power I've been given may exceed even theirs, but if I use it, as they did... Who's to say things won't end the same way? Come now, brother. I think the events of recent days have made it abundantly clear that we are not our ancestors. As well you know. You're right. They made crystals. We destroy them. In crafting their artificial heart, the Fallen sought to emulate the Divine. But that is not the path we have chosen. No. We don't want to be gods. We just want to be free. Well said. If one does not learn from the mistakes of the past, one is doomed to repeat them. And so, I mean to write down everything you've told me to the very last detail, that those who come after might learn from our travails, and perhaps, just perhaps, forge a brighter future for our descendants. <laughs>